Roll that roll down your window. <clears throat> Do me a favor, say hello, Ike. I'm a bonehead trucker. <laughs> what a bonehead! Really? Come on, you can't be serious. Oh, we got some Johnny Mac coming at you. But first, it's time for Tales from the Truck Stop, and you got me and some field reporters. You know how we do it here. So if you like this kind of garbage, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Hit that like button. If you don't hit that like button, I'm going to make old Swifty Swift back into you. All right? That's the, hey, you may see that in this video. All right? These videos and clips are sent to you, sent to me, by you. Well, I can't talkie talkie uh, through our email contact at boneheadtruckers.com. Also on Facebook, say no to bonehead truckers. It's called say no to bonehead truckers. That's the name of the group. There's a special link down there in the description. Watch this driver. He's at a truck stop because <laughs> this is tales from a truck stop. So, but he had to go really bad. He had to go really bad right there where he's at. Now, I know that a lot of you guys think that Bucky's is a truck stop, and you think that Bucky should allow truck drivers on their freaking lots, okay? But when you got guys like this right here sitting there taking a, a whiz in the parking lot, who wants that? I know I wouldn't if I owned something like that, right? This guy, you know, he was all, he had to go. Like, he had to go. Right? Like, he was just like, okay, I gotta get out of my white Volvo really fast. Alright? Really fast. But, uh, I, I'm gonna just nonchalantly pull up my zipper and pretend like I wasn't doing anything. <laughs> Alright? That's what he was doing. But, but that ain't it. I didn't stop the video right here because it gets a little better. Or worse. However you want to look at it. Watch what happens next. Oh, he goes and leaves. You mean to tell me he couldn't go drive up close to the building, right, to the, to the truck stop and go and go use the bathroom inside? Nasty. Just freaking nasty. I like this guy right here. At least he's on that. Hey, is that Joe Biden? Doggone! Joe Biden, look at you. Let's go, Brandon. How about that daggone that freaking Joe, Joe Biden got his freaking wiener in the freaking couch and taking a leak. Hey, uh, uh, this ain't no bueno for caca. Oh, Swifty Swift over here hitting the big old nice W9s too. Look at that. Shame on the mess. Oh, terrible situation. I can't know they're big time court problem. Doggone student, where's the old freaking instructor? Shame on that dog plugging mess, doggone. You know, I'm getting really tired of you talking about us swift drivers. We do our best. Why don't y'all pick on somebody else? I don't know. But you guys need to leave Swift alone because it's my favorite company. It's my favorite company. Oh yeah, because we don't do this. Oh no. But that's okay though, because y'all always just picking on us. And I'm getting really tired of you guys picking on us Swift drivers. We're not that bad. No. No, we're not. Hey, swing wide, it's a freaking trailer. Swing wide, it's a freaking trailer. You can go get the church today at boneheadtruckers.com. Here we go, bonehead truckers. This guy is blocking two to three lanes because he wants to get to that first lane on the on, on the left. The lane over here already opened up, and he still didn't back. He could have backed up and gone into it, but no, he wants that lane. A truck already. Another driver, the one before this one, went straight through to the pump. 
Now this guy is going through, through, through to an open pump. And this is still here blocking. Bong head truckers. Wrong way. Oh my God. Bong head trucker. Rookie driver. Hey, hey, hey! Oh, oh, I can move! Oh, I'm a power of the universe! Oh, man! <laughs> Boy! <laughs> he tried to move the rock! <laughs> Boy, head truck! <laughs> I'm bald head human. <laughs> he tried to move that one. <laughs> Bone head truckers, Johnny Mac here. All right, we're at a uh, Flying J in uh, Ripton, California. And uh, so I pulled out of my park and I wanted to just top off before I go and uh, get some freezer food. Dole, pineapple, I guess, something like that. That's what I'm picking up. But anyway, so I pull up at the fuel aisle. Um, and so this guy in front of me uh, wasn't fueling. And then I sat here for about a minute. And uh, he came out. Maybe he had to just go inside and uh, pay inside. Uh, so I'm not going to really bitch at the guy in front of me. So it was only a couple minutes and he's fueling now. But this guy over here, this guy whatever the hell his truck name is G-U-R-I Guri he's been sitting here uh, just blocking the whole fuel aisle for a while and so let's see this might take two two parts of my video so let's see here what time is it so local time is 9.30 so it's 9.30 uh, I've been here say four minutes so, uh, 9.26 when I pulled in here. Let's see how long it is before this bonehead comes out, moves his truck, fuels or does whatever. Um, I'm gonna wait, get my fuel, and then uh, we'll see if we can film some more. Hopefully we can catch the guy out there and, uh, and get him live on video. Um, but yeah, what a bonehead. Uh, you know, just go ahead, pull up, park your truck, right there, before the pumps. Go inside and uh, go get yourself a soda water and a cheeseburger or whatever else it is you want. Maybe a shower. Sure, why not, you know? And block everybody else because there is a line. There's a line of trucks. I mean, it, all the way around. Trucks behind me. Trucks here. Trucks there. Trucks there. Trucks in the front. Up over there. This guy here. Uh, so there's this place is packed. And we got one bonehead. Gurry 2110 Golf Uniform Romeo Indigo G U R I 2110 Anyway, that's it. So that's all I got from now. Um, we'll see. I'm going to pull up. I'm going to fuel. See how long it takes for this guy to come out. Uh, hopefully, he comes out like at some point while I'm fueling. That way, I can get him on video and ask him what's going on. All right. Don't go anywhere. I've got a second part coming. See ya. So I sat here for a few more minutes, pulled up to the pump, and then uh, something's going on with my pump anyway, and it's not working, so I have to go inside, actually give him my card, and that's what happened with the guy in front of me. But hey, Gurry, he pulled up just a second ago, come out of the back and sat, and he's, been, he's, in, the, he's in his truck, and he's not fueling, he's not doing anything. So I gotta go inside, I've got to go inside now to give him my card. I'm pump number 26 to give him my card and, and fix this all up because the pump keypad isn't working. So I'm going to go inside. I'm going to kill some more time. We'll, we'll come back out and we'll see what Gurry, G U R I, 2110 is doing. So don't go anywhere. we got a lot more to come. Let's, let's, I hope I can get him on video. We'll see. All right. It's three parts of this video. So I went in store. I, uh, the only pump that's not working over here is 26. It's the one I pulled in. I got the sun behind me. Uh, so I'm still sitting here. I mean, I just came out, waited a couple of customers, gave them my card and all that. So now I can go ahead and fuel. 
But here we are, we're coming back. Let's see if this guy's fueling. So this bastard still isn't fueling. He's just sitting in his truck, taking 30 minutes. So I'm gonna go ahead and start my pump. I'm gonna go ahead and start my pump and get my shit going and then we're gonna knock on his door. So don't go anywhere, this is gonna be interesting. I put my both my pumps in and we're talking to the guy sitting in his truck. He's been here, you've been here about a half an hour already. Uh -huh. Yeah, cause you pulled up and I pulled up behind you. It's now, I go, I go. it's 10 minutes to uh, nine now. So when I got here at 928, you were over there and you were still in your truck. So you were still in your truck, then you pulled forward and you haven't even fueled. Ah, I go there. Yeah, you went there. Did you, did you fuel yet? Yeah. You fueled. No, you didn't. No, I go there. I go there. You go there. But you haven't fueled yet. Because I watched you. You were there. And then I watched you pull up. And you were still in your truck. So you were still in your truck. You haven't fueled. You've been blocking the fuel aisle for like a half an hour. You're just a bonehead. Hey. Hey, roll down your window. Roll down your window. Do me, do me a favor. Roll down, roll down your window. <clears throat> do me a favor. Say hello, Ike. I'm a bonehead trucker. You're just a fucking bonehead. <laughs> what a bonehead. Really? Come on. You can't be serious. There goes the bonehead. I'm so glad I got up in his face and said something because these lovely people. Sorry, I'm keep swearing. These idiots. Need to learn a lesson. Trucker with Johnny Mac. See ya. TRC Freight offers 88%, all right? On their website, you're gonna ask, well, what are the deductions? They gotta have a lot of deductions. On their website, it is black and white, the deductions, okay? So I'm not gonna go down the list, all right? That's something that you can do if you're really interested, go to trcandme.com, all right? That's what you're gonna do.